In this video, let us see about the searching and insertion operation in a binary search tree. So, I hope you remember what is a binary search tree. That the nodes on the left part of the binary search tree will be having a lesser value when compared to the root node. And the nodes on the right part of the uh, subtree will have the value greater than the, that of the root node. Right, so uh, say that we are performing a searching operation here in a binary search tree. So this searching operation is used to find whether a given value was present in a tree or not. So this searching operation will begin uh, mainly from the uh, root node. So say that the root node of the tree is 45. So the uh, searching operation will check whether first the binary search tree is empty. So if it is empty, then we say that the value what we are searching for is not present in the tree, right? So if there is nodes in the tree, then the search uh, function will check out whether the uh, key value that is to be searched uh, is equal to the value of the root node. So if the if you are searching out for the value, say 56, uh, now it will check out whether the root node of the tree is matching with the search value, say 56. Uh. So search value, search key or search value is 56. So first it will compare with the root node. Say it is not matching. So if it is not matching, now what does it do? Because it will check out whether the value to be searched is lesser than the value of the root node. So if it is lesser than the value, then it will move towards the left part of the tree. Or else if it is greater than, then it will move towards the right part of the tree. So this is about the searching operation. So let us consider now an example of searching for the L value, say 67. Search key value is 67. So when we start from the root node, so comparing 45 with 67, 67 is greater. So now we have to move to the right part of the tree. Now come to the right part, 56. Now coming to 56, 67 is greater than 56. Now we have to move to the uh, right part of the tree. Now again, 67 is lesser than the uh, node 78. So now we have to move to the left part of the tree and the element that we are searching for, for is found in the left part of the node 78. So this is how we perform the uh, search operation. Now let us uh, see how to write on the pseudocode for this uh, search operation. What is going to be our step one? So let us first write down the uh, function. Say we are writing a function called search element. Search element. We are giving the input as tree and the value to be searched as well. And now in step one. So our step one is going to be if the value that we are searching is found as at the root node of the tree so if the tree's data part is equal to the value then we are going to return the uh, node itself so it is the root node so we'll return the tree if not so in step two if the value to be searched is not found in the root node now we'll write down else if if the value to be searched if the value is lesser than the root node value okay now if it is lesser we have to perform search only on which part of the tree so we have to return and perform a recursive search calling the function recursively on the trees left part right so trees left comma value okay and if the value to be searched is greater than the trees data that is the root node then we have supposed to perform a recursive search on the right part of the tree. So return search element calling the function recursively on the right part of the tree. So this is the uh, I'll pseudocode to perform the search operation. So step three is to exit or end. Fine. Now, now let us see how to insert a new node in a binary search tree. So how do we perform the insertion operation so let us uh, take out one example first and then let us start moving on to the insertion operation so consider the binary search tree say that you have a binary search tree 45 is a root node 
then 39, 56, 54 and 78. Fine. Now, so assume that you have to insert now. Your objective is to insert node 12. Okay. So if you have to insert node 12, what do you do first? First check out whether the node 12 is lesser than or greater than the root node, right? So if node 12 is lesser, then we have to move to the left part of the tree. So we are moving to the left part of the tree, 39. So now we insert on the, insert it as a left child of this node 39, the node 12. Got it? Fine. So this is how we insert the node 12 into the uh, binary search tree. Now, say that you are supposed to insert a node 55. So how do we insert the node 55? So first check out whether the node 55 is lesser or greater than the uh, root node. Yes, it is greater than the root node. So if it is greater, move to the right part of the tree. Now, the node 55 is lesser than node 56. So move to the left part now comparing with node 54 55 is greater now you are supposed to insert this node 55 as the right child of this node 54 okay so this is how insertion operation is being done now let us see how to write down the uh, pseudocode for the binary uh, search tree insertion so let us write down the uh, function so inserting the value and the tree okay so step one say that you have only you don't have say that you don't have any node in a tree and the node which you are going to insert is now going to be the first node then how do you deal with that case so if your tree is null so if your tree is null then it means that the node which you are inserting is going to be your first node right so when your tree is null first allocate the memory for your node so how do we allocate you can write down allocate memory for the node that is the tree okay and then you can set your trees data with the value which is nothing but the trees data means that it is a root node right so hope i can write down it is the root node fine and then there is no there will not be any left child and right child so we will set the trees left and the trees right as null as this is the one and only one node say in step two assume a scenario that you already have node in a tree so if you already have a node in a tree what are we supposed to check out we have to check out else if if the value that we are going to insert okay so else if if the value which we are going to insert, if it is lesser than the root node of the tree, so lesser than the tree's data, then we perform, we call the function recursively, we perform the insertion on the tree's left part and then we insert the value, right? If not else, okay, if the value was greater than the tree's uh, data, which is a root node, then we perform the insertion operation on the trees right and we call this function recursively so next your step three is going to be exit so this is about the searching operation and insertion operation in a binary search tree